Welcome to Up Late. I'm Natisha Lance. And I'm Jeff Hellinger. Glad to have you aboard tonight. We begin with a warning from police. Another fake, phony, fraudulent cop is out there. Roswell police say the phony officer tried to slap handcuffs on a worker at a massage parlor. These blurry security cam photos show the fake officer. Police say he showed up to the spa drinking beer, then he targeted a masseuse during a massage. And what he did next, police are calling sexual abuse. John Sherrick is on the story for us tonight. It was this past Thursday night at this shopping plaza on busy Woodstock Road in Roswell. A man walked into this business, Massage Angel, ordered a massage, paid for it, and halfway through the session with a masseuse, a woman. He got off the table. And police say he suddenly became aggressive. Stated that he was a Roswell police officer. He became criminally aggressive. Um, attempted to arrest the masseuse. He tried to handcuff her. Roswell police officer Sean Thompson says the woman at first might have been afraid she'd done something wrong and that maybe he was an an undercover officer. What did he do and then? Performed an indecent act in front of her. Then left, drove away. Security cameras captured only blurry images of him, but clear enough for police to confirm he is not a Roswell police officer. Detectives have issued a bulletin to massage businesses across Metro Atlanta to see if the same man might have targeted them, a warning in case he tries to strike again. In recent fake cop cases, someone posing as a police officer has blue lights and maybe even a fake badge and tries to pull people over to assault them. Police always advising people, if they're suspicious, don't stop, but slow down. Turn on your flashers, call 911. This time, police say the victim had no way to get away. They want to find out who the man is and stop him fast. We don't want people going around just saying they're a police officer, trying to arrest people. They want to catch this man before he can attack again and possibly hurt his next victim.